You ever get punched so hard you think somebody's behind you as you rest up against the wall? Oh, He's right behind us. Never in my life will I want to get hit that hard, bro. Please. Mr. Marcelo, I mean the entire brothel is destroyed, sir. You want me to what? Call some whores over? Mr. Marcelo, you're like 70 years old. I know your shit don't work no more, sir. Sorry about that. Tommy Angelo here. Ready to bust more shots and get more cool. <laughs> I haven't got nothing yet, bro. But I'm still gonna try. Hey, what? Welcome back hey, to another video for today. Sarah, where did you go? You realize all this happened because we were trying to save you? Every great battle starts over a woman! Intermezzo. <laughs> Jesus Christ, dummy. You're confessing to a shootout in a church. And I ain't even through the hard stuff yet. You know, I could take you in right now, put your blind bars, and tell you old and gray. Maybe. If you think you can make any of it stick. But then you'd never know about Morello. Hey, fellas, sorry to keep you waiting. My shift just started. What you having? Two lunch specials, please. And more coffee. You know what? Let's bring the whole pot. All right, we've come this far together. What kind of heat did you get from the church? How I tell you about how I joined the gang. How I got the, 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 the boxer dude. I tell you about my shootout with the church. I tell you about my race car experience. And you instantly brought me no lunch. Where's my food at? It says second waitress. What happened to the first one? Oh, she did bring me a plate. My fault, my fault, my fault. They switched shifts. Okay. I would have turned it up in this restaurant, bro. I swear to you. It's a strange thing. Nothing really came of it all. Always figured Celieri paid off someone somewhere because it wasn't even in the papers. She on her job. She get a tip. We just had to lay low for seven, eight months. Damn. The cops kept showing up at the bar just to remind us they were watching. And Frank caught wind that Morello was helping Galati get reelected, hoping he'd go after the Don. When I recovered some account books from Morello's offices, 33 was a pretty good year for him. Bastard knew we were bleeding out before we did. While we were busy keeping our heads down, he started moving in on our rackets. Quiet at first, a few trucks go missing. Uh, top burner has one too many highballs, drives off a bridge. One of our regular pickups suddenly closes up shop, moves upstate. You need didn't catch on? Not me. I think maybe Polly <clears throat> smelled something. But even with the cops looking over our shoulders and Morello circling, we were still making good money. Mm. And with the Dom worried about keeping the heat off, we didn't have much to do, except drink, have a few laughs. Every time I went into Celieri's, there was Sarah. So it was a good year, until Frank. A Coletti, a dance consigliere. Yeah, that's right. He set me straight. He set us all straight. Whoa, what did Mr. Burns do? Talk about it. There's a lot of buzz around town about you guys. Yeah, we got into a little scrap last night. It's no big deal. I don't care about the bar fight, Tom. I care how it looks when you walk into a club and buy everyone around. Uh, we gotta do something with that, though. Then blow it at the track on Sunday. Or take a dame to a show. Or invest it, for Christ's sake. <laughs> you want me to become one of those Wall Street boys? <laughs> don't sass me, Tommy. I'm trying to teach you the ropes so you don't get strangled by them. You ever have a dog, Tom? Sure. A little mutt when I was a kid. When I was eight or nine, before I came over from Sicily, I had this beautiful skinny Cherneco de Letna. Like a little greyhound. Fastest dog you've ever seen. That's how I met the Don. We started setting up races together. Betting on her with coins and rifle shells. There wasn't another dog that could catch her. She never lost. Until the day she did. 
We were only out of pocket knife, but I never saw the Don so angry. She got old on you? No. Pregnant. She went into heat, got out of the yard, and every dog in town had a turn. You're like that dog, Tommy. Every time you flash your money around, you're a bitch in heat. Ooh. And everyone in that club is now looking to fuck you. Ooh. And once you get fucked, you're no good to us. Wow. Do you understand? Uh, you made your point. Good. Because you need to think about your career here. Look, Paulie's at his ceiling. He's the guy we want in a tussle, but he's not smart enough to run anything. Sam is loyal, but he has no vision. But you, Tommy, you could run this town someday. Well, I appreciate that, Frank. So, uh, what happened to the dog? The Don tried to drown her. I broke his nose. Cap. You can let me off here. I know it's not Cap, but it's like, bro. The Don? Cut it out, man. Give Sarah my best, Tommy. Yeah, he know you, he know you, he know what's up. You don't think he know what's up? He see everything. He is a human uh, surveillance camera. Back then, everything went through Frank. The plans, the orders, the money. You could get the call day or night. Ah, Tommy. Frank says to wait for him in the garage out in the back. Eh? You got the job, I think. Thanks, Luigi. Sarah's cooking. She's bringing something over. In this rain? She's a good girl. I'll see you tomorrow, Luigi. Look at Luigi trying to get me pressed up with his daughter, trying to get a grandson. Luigi, relax. I'm a killer, sure. dude. Why do you got time for that? Day, when the boss was still with that phone, we got called out to a hit. Some uh, politician on the take. And his storms just rage. And we're driving out. Thanks for waiting, Tom. The Don and I had to go over last month's numbers again. Sure. So what's the job? I want you to help Sam and Polly with the shipment we've got coming in tonight. The good stuff? Straight from Canada. Where do you need me? Sam's gone to meet our friends from the north at the farm outside of town. Polly will oversee the trucks bringing the shipment into the city. But I want you to go with him. Be an extra pair of eyes. Make sure it all goes smoothly. Okay. Get the car from Ralphie to meet Paulie at the warehouse. He's got heaters in case you run into any trouble. Uh, sure, Frank. No problem. Good. Now bring the Canadian home safe, Tommy. There is already a case you're marked for the Don. What is this little red booklet I'm looking at? Great. Oh, he black. There go a black dude. Okay. This mama motor is yours. If you want it, Tommy. Working late, Ruffy? I says his sleep when F -F Frank sleeps. Man, he's been working us hard. Pause. Morello's taking bites out of business everywhere <laughs> else, Ruff. Bulls records where we shine. We gotta stay ahead someplace. Ah, well, I, I just f -f -f fixed the cars to Tom. I, I changed the p -p plates again. You can't be too careful. See you in the morning. Okay. You didn't see my car here? No! And nobody looked, huh? Nobody give a damn about me, huh? 
Oh yeah, 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 yeah. No, 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 no. Let's talk about it. Let's talk about it. Let's talk about it. So no Look at you already snitching. So nobody give a damn about me, huh? No, let's talk about it. I got something I want to talk about. Oh, okay, okay. Maybe, maybe you want to talk about this then, huh? You want to talk about this? You want to talk about this? You want to talk about this? I, I got hit and nobody moved. Stop right where you are. Oh shit, bro! Don't. No. What are we? Okay. Okay. Watch this. Oh my gosh! Execution style. I just wanted to be respected. I just wanted to be respected. I just wanted to be respected. Come on, Tom! Hey, hey! Watch it, pal. Just dry it out. Tell me, are you strung out, bro? Relax. No displacement. Crack uh, yeah. We've done a few pickups at the farm before. Don't worry. It's water. There ain't nothing but cow shit and shine out here. It's gonna be an easy few clams. Boys will load up the trucks. We'll come straight back. Yeah, let's make it quick. I got some place to be. Ah, uh, you see it Sarah yeah. later. Luigi's little girl, your night shift. <laughs> You're something else, pal. Protecting the girl's virginity one day and taking it the next. Lay off, Polly. Ah, uh, come on. I'm just kidding. She's a good girl. You settle down, she'll straighten you right out. Holly, I don't want to have this combo with you, bro. Going home to a couch. <laughs> Do you want a I girl or not? I kind of story she could tell about her old man, though. He was a stone-cold killer back in the day. I wouldn't know. You know she's been helping out behind the bar since she was a kid. I bet she's seen and heard a few things. Probably knows more about our business than we do. She knows enough not to ask me too many questions. That's good. She won't ever make a liar out of you. Christ. You ought to marry her just for that. God damn it. Sam should be waiting here, but I don't see him. Something smells off. Don't let your Pekka get all shriveled up. Probably just trying to get out of the rain. Or into the bootleg. <laughs> That'll wake him. He ain't coming. Okay. Let's go find him. That bastard is just three sheets, and I'm wrecking a new suit for nothing. I swear I'm gonna kill him. Here, just in case Frank was right. I'm gonna go grab them boys, get them sorted out. You go ahead, see what's what. We'll catch up with you. Something about this feels off for real, bro. With Frank and Polly both. I don't think Frank would set me up. And I'm hoping this isn't a setup, but where is Sam at? You know what I'm saying? I'm going, I'm going head where up. the hell are you hiding? Hey, buddy. You couldn't tell. You thought he was really Jesus. knocked out with his Drop eyes open, though? Your weapon. You first. We don't have time for this. Sorry, pal. Guess we're doing this the hard way. Okay then. Get over here! Oh my I got gosh! Down. Oh my gosh! Hey, over here. Where is where is Paulie at? Oh, you are a straight bitch, bro. I can tell. I can tell. Whoa! Whoa! What you want to do? What you want to do? Okay, so, so you try to get active. Oh, 
man. Oh, he, oh, oh, he, he advancing. Sit down. My last shot, my last shot. Let's go. Whoa, boy, was y'all the feds? Canadian telegram received at uh, can cousins meet at usual place. Uncle is happy that gift is on the way. This was a setup. Uncle is happy that gift is on the way. I mean, we know it's a setup, but like, they talking in code on some like pizza, on some pizza pizza. You know what I'm talking about, y'all? My right. thinkers out there, my thinkers and shakers and doers. This on some pizza. Wow, it's me, Tom. Y'all are clowns. Holly. What took you so long? Looking for Sammy? Did you find him? Nah, not yet. Just him. Canadian crew. Dollars to donuts to rest the face down in the dirt, too. You look like a Muppet in the face. Something about oh, Christ. Cops, Tommy. Well, how would I know? They didn't show a badge. God, they didn't say anything. They must be in Morello's pocket. This bastard. He can't even let us have this one racket. Forget about it, Tom. We gotta find Sam and get out of here. They already let us know that Polly was doing deals without, um, what's his name? The Don knowing, bro. These guys are the real deal. They gotta be cops from the Border Patrol. Polly, you are trash. I could have died just now. I'm telling Frank. <laughs> I can't tell Frank, bro. I just got to deal with the consequences. Okay, search the farm, find Sam, get the hell out. Anyone else, we slip them the bump. Get it? I don't know what that means. And I don't even have a, a me uh, melee weapon. Oh my gosh. All a shot in the back of the head. Must have been lined up. Poor bastards. I was about to say, I know that's not uh Sam laid out like that. Canadian passports. Yep. Tommy, when are you going to step up and start calling big boy shots? Who are you? Wow! You just reading? Oh, 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 okay, okay, okay. What's up then? I got big artillery too. I got big boy artillery. What y'all want to do? And again, Polly, you're nowhere to be found during the during the action. You ain't got no blood on your hands. We need to just pull up to Morello front door. Oh, some rocks at the window. Let him think it's a, it's a slimmy. Pull out a blick. Blick him. Sam! Oh, shit. Okay, okay, okay. Did your bitch We got you, Sam. Oh, you're not even Sam. Who are you? Who are y'all shooting at out here? Let's go, Sam! Sam! Why? Why wouldn't I shout you out? Push through! What is this? Bro, don't nobody care about no history lesson, bro. This ain't um Why every history class taught by a coach, bro? I never understand. Are you friend? Yeah, 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 yeah. It was always a, a dang football coach teaching history. 
You got hell, hell, hella plays to remember. How do you know all this about the French Revolution? I don't get you. Shoot him! Oh, that was nice. I'm about to blow this. Nope, I didn't say it. I didn't say it, so I'm not gonna pause it. Nope. Almost though. Oh, 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 I'm on enemy lines. I'm on enemy lines. I'm on enemy lines. I'm on enemy lines. You should still have big ammo in this Tommy gun. Matter of fact, let me run around and get some. I'm fine. I'm fine with I'm fine with 60 rounds. Maybe Polly didn't set me up. Maybe I'm overreacting. You boys stay here and watch our backs. Plug anyone who gets within 100 yards. Except us. Not the Stacys. Sam dies right here. Okay, just hang on. I'll go get the truck. Then we'll take you to the doctor. Hey, hey, you gonna make it, Sam? Tommy, stay here with him. I'll be back. I'll be back in a flash. Cause I get the I get the feeling okay. Polly doesn't really get respected like that. So that's probably why he'd be the one to be like, you know what? Everybody thinks I'm just some dumb drunk. Whole time masterminding it. It'll be okay, Sam. We survived worse. There's a first aid cabinet right. You sure we are? Did Pauly just get clapped? My whole plan went out the window. Chest down. What's up? How do you throw grenades? Oh, get from. Yep, yep. That's what I needed. That's what I needed. Yep. Trying to trying to do too much. Trying to be a hero. You. What are you? You really trying to go upstairs on me? You trying to go upstairs on me? Y'all are built like Terminator though. What kind of body armor is that? Iron Man? Trash. Iron Man body armor? Oh Christ. Tony and Donnie too? I tried. Yeah. What a fucking massacre. Iron Man? What? How Sam? Well, he ain't any worse. I'll go get him. Keep an eye out. Is it Iron Man? I need the doctor, Polly. Yeah, I can see that here. Hang on. I got you. I got you. Okay. Polly did come back with a truck. Okay, okay. Hey, we're gonna get y'all patched up. Okay. His uh, tummy got bloodlust. Who is that over there? Who is that? Got more company. Where did they find a warthog right. from? Get in. Okay. Oh my gosh. I'm right here, Sam. There's some ammo and a Thompson back there somewhere. Bro, this gun ain't gonna do nothing to this. Behind you? Blast them down. Just don't let them get past us. If these dudes are from Canada, how did they get what? Oh, that's a cop. Oh, duh. Okay. Well, interesting. Okay, that thing I'm a, back yep. there is huge. Where the hell did they find that truck? God, Lee, what do? You think we're okay? 
Okay, one of them ran into a truck, uh, went into a pole. I know you're not asleep. Should have been doing that. Where? This don't look like a hospital, Polly. You okay? We're in trouble, Tom. Ooh, that was a clean photo for a thumbnail. I lit him up. How somebody still hopped out that, that car? Nobody losing they hat, huh? I'm spraying. This is this is unbelievable. That thing's got us, Holly. We got. Oh my gosh! Uh, 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 I'm a real man too, Tom. You cool? Good shit. Good shit. Good shit. to go in the passenger. I'm sorry. Why well, my hat got to fall off, but theirs don't. You know what I'm saying, bro? Say less. works why would why did Polly hit one of these while he's driving he's he's flying away from border patrol and a gatling gun on the tank he goes ah! like bro keep keep your eyes on the road bro i got this he hit a hole put his hand behind the rest like why is your hand behind the the, the headrest these are bullets we did it we did it. Okay, we're here, Tom. You get Sam out. I'm gonna go wake up the doc. Sam, Sam. We made it. We're at the doctor's house. This is three, I owe you. Let's go, Sam. Paulie, what the hell are you doing here so late? Uh, uh, evening, Doc. Sorry to wake you, but um, we had a little accident. We got an injured man out here. All right, bring him inside. Okay. Very respectful, very calm, collected. Okay, uh, I'll stay with Sam. You can take the truck back. Call it a night. No, I'll wait. The doctor already got his hands full. No sense in both of us breathing down his neck. Go on, Tom. I'm gonna be fine. Okay. Hey, you did good tonight. Nah, bro. That ain't cutting it. We're just not going to talk about anything that happened. The Canadians. The deaths. The stacks of bodies in the barn.
You got you gotta you gotta talk to Frank. You gotta let him know. We're still I don't wanna pull up to Sarah's in this. I don't wanna pull up to Sarah's in this. Sarah! We gotta talk. We got to talk. We got to talk. And I'm not gonna drive down this alley. He's right behind us. You ever get punched so hard you think somebody's behind you as you rest up against the wall? Never in my life will I want to get hit that hard, bro. Please. Look at her reading and drinking big wine. You want some kids? Tommy, You're press late. her. Press her. Dinner's cold. Okay. Right. Can I get a hello? How are you? Work. That's a broken man right there. Damn. This is a woman that understands duty and responsibility. She she saw that he was troubled. She said, let me not. OK, OK. What's the next move? You going to panic? You going to go wash your hands. What you finna do? You going to rub it all on my fucking suit? Are you serious? That's not even my blood. OK. Good shit, good shit, good shit. Good shit. Marry me. Woo! I knew it. I knew it. She said, okay. I could just tell, bro. Something was in the air that something was in the air that night. And it was not Banyan. Cause if it was, the babies would have been created that night. Bond, wine, and a good read and some killing for that testosterone boost? Oh my gosh. I wouldn't know. Most things I've killed be some bugs. <laughs> oh, Myrta, who is that? I'm having so much fun, bro. Hey, bud. I came as soon as I got your message. Sit down, Tom. Uh oh. We have a mole, Tom. I knew it. It's Polly, no. bro. I knew it. Oh. I was up all night driving myself nuts trying to figure it out. I started thinking maybe it's one of our guys. We aren't paying his fair share. Someone with a light wallet. Maybe looking to Morello for a new suit. Right. Frank wasn't around, so I went to the safe to get the account books to see who's getting cents on the dollar he's earned. What do you know? The books are gone, Tom. Frank. More than 50 years I've known him. Oh, what? Everything I have, I got with Frank. You know what's crazy about that too? You know how they say people who are liars never trust anybody? People that cheat are always suspicious of people cheating? That's probably why Frank hit Tommy with that speech about his dog. He is like, if you get fucked, then it's like, bro, what are you talking? I'm driving right now. Why are you talking about dogs and heat and fucking and bussing, bro? Shut up. Turn the radio on. But now I'm sitting here thinking he was projecting. He was the one out here getting effed in the boot. Whoa, bro. And now. Out of Don, though, and the Don called Big Tom, and Tom is talking to the big feds. You can't trust nobody, that's crazy. Nobody in the streets, bro. That's why I'm a square. And every buck we've earned, every dime we've paid out, it's all logged in those books. Frank hands those over to the feds, we're finished. Frank respects one person in this whole town, and that's you. Mm -hmm. This has got to be some kind of misunderstanding. I've been calling them all day. I went by his place. He's gone. His wife and kid are gone. But why? I don't know. I'm sure he has his reasons. Maybe he's 
still smarting over the dog. But when you tried to drown it? Yeah. <sighs> Same one I shot after he wouldn't let me sink her. Hmm. He said Don always gets his way. I was a way. stupid kid, Tommy. But grudge or no grudge, we gotta get those books back. Shake down all our stories. See who knows what. When you catch up to Frank, you get those books. And if he doesn't have them on him, you make him tell you where to find them. After that, you do what we gotta do. Vincenzo's waiting for you with a clean car. Wow. You see every, you see, no, no matter where the Don go, he always got somebody in a cut. He can't even go sit at the park without worrying to being dropped in the sea. Square life is just the life for me, bro. I know somebody watching this like, quit calling yourself that. No, nigga, shut the f Tough day It's my day, video, Tom. bro. We gotta keep a lid on this, Tom. Start with Biff, but don't give him nothing. I got you a clean set of wheels. And something special here, if you want it. Oh, the, oh, the, the sawed off? Yeah, I need that. Frank sees a Lepara, he'll know. It always work. Fuck are you, Ricky Ricardo? Lucky I can't swing on you, bro. Tommy, what's the rumpus? You know what the deal is, Biff. Heard any big news lately? Something that Don might want to know. Yeah, it depends. What's it worth to you? 20 Biff. bucks. How about 40? All right, spill. The FBI is in town. They're getting something from Morello, but I, I don't know what. How'd you hear? Little Tony got some guy drunk in the black cat and drove him home. Heard a bunch of stuff, so he's the guy you want to see. Okay. Thanks. When Biff oh, said, a pleasure, Tommy. when Biff just told me, um, what's it to you? I pushed left trigger so fast. I would have ruined the mission. Like, why would I draw the, the shotgun on him? Because he asked, what's it to you? You don't know me like that. I just joined the gang. All right. Looks like the place. Oh, I was wrong. I thought we were going to the Don when it says safe house. All right, we made it. Bitch ass Frank. Is it Matthew Lillard on the left? That's Matt and the, closing the door. Okay. Oh, Frank is going down, bro. I hate Take driving this account books, Frank. Frank ain't never followed uh, street guidelines. He need to cut it out. Christ, they're flying him out of state or something. Fuck, this ain't good. Now you're concerned? Ooh, I didn't know, I didn't know, I didn't know. If I would've blew that. I was about to run up and really shoot this, this whole car up. Who are these people? The FBI? Guy just flashed a badge at me and forced me out. Oh, open your eyes, white old chap. Airport's closed to the public. Are they asking me to shoot up this and I'm going down my road. I'm going down my road. This road leads nowhere. They can't be asking me to just shoot my way into the airport. 
There it is. Run the perimeter, run the perimeter. Yep, yep, go inside, go inside, yep. I'm in there. Yes, sir. Yeah, get your ass inside, um, um, Hitman. Um, that's not even who I wanted to say. I'm thinking of a, a that one bald actor, bro, who be in all the action movies. Jason Statham. Yep, y'all know. What is this? Some notes. Informant handover. Twelve o'clock. We shut down the airport. One o'clock. Informant and FBI escort leave safe house. And one fifteen. Informant exchange and take it to Hangar Five. We got account. We get accounts book after informant handed over. Hangar five. I don't have any stealth moves though. Do I? Yeah. Yes, I do. Yes, I do. Yes, I do. Hmm. Reload that. Y'all ain't hear a thing. Y'all ain't hear a thing. Morello hasn't the honor to even show his face. For a rat like you? Nah. Get in the car. He wanted to meet Morello? What a what a clown. Catch up to Frank on his way to Anger 5. Okay. Bet. Someone's here with us! I only got shit. I only got shit, bro. Get off me. Good shot. Whoever shot that, good shit, good shit. Good, good cut off. Good cut off. You played me. Ah, I gotta get in there. Damn it. Uh. Cool. I couldn't let Frank get out of here. Nice. You have some shells left Tom. over? Frank. The Don sent me. I figured as much. I'm sorry it had to be you, Tommy. Anything you want me to tell him? I wish it could have shaken out better, but Morello finally came after me. It's okay. You can come out. Wife and kid, huh? Wow. Morello offered me a simple trade. The Don's account books for our lives and tickets out of this town. You hand the books over yet? I'm not so stupid, Don. They're safe. Morello was waiting for this. It's a key to a box in the Grand Imperial Bank downtown. I told Morello I'd hand it over after the plane was fueled and ready to go. His men were meant to fetch it before we left. I took care of them. Tell them to get on a plane. Go on march. Alice, get aboard. Frank, you're coming with us. Not right now, honey. I understand this wife knows that her that her husband is going to die and get shotgun blasted to the chest or face. But I just, I don't know. I just think it's funny how she's like, you're getting on the plane with us, Frank. Like, do you not see me here with this sawed off? <laughs> Imagine, like, like, let's say I got the shotgun at, 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 uh, at Frank, right? And I hear her say that. She's like, you're coming with us, right, Frank? I would have been like, Ch -ch. I can't even play around like that, bro. No, I wouldn't. I'm a square. I would have been like, I I I I'd let you if I could, but I can't because it's a dying artist. That's what I would have really said, bro. Straight clown. Just get buckled in. 
Tommy and I, we have some serious business to discuss. For Frank. Get on the plane, much. Right. For Alice. For me. Get on the goddamn plane, please. If you ain't never had to talk to your chick like that, y'all was never really in love. If you ain't never had to say, get on the fucking plane, then you ain't really been in a real relationship. Or if you ain't never said, be quiet, damn, then you ain't really never been in a real relationship. You been paid yet? Yeah. Now you've been paid twice. You take the ladies wherever they want to go. Money talks. Money, yes, sir. money talks, man. Thank you, Tom. Christ, Frank. Why didn't you ask us for help? I guess I just wanted out. One way or the other. I'm tired, Tommy. Tired of lying to my wife. Tired of checking under my car every time I take a Sunday drive. Mm. And tired of waiting for the dawn to put two in my temple. Right here? Right, wait for them to take off. You gonna blow his whole <laughs> noggin yeah, off. You, Is he serious? Whoa! Whoa! And you paid him? Well, I guess we got the, we got the, we got the, um, you know. Wow. We got the books. You really let Frank go. You are a square too. You are a square, Tommy. Embrace it, fam. Welcome to the light. Ah. We still driving this? Come on. Game, why doesn't the game refresh my whip like GTA? Why do I still have my hood disconnected? Why am I yelling? It's funner that way. Ah. The f <coughs> on my face. Good afternoon, sir. Where's the safety deposit boxes? With my colleague downstairs, sir. Thanks. I can't punch anymore. I wasn't going to punch her. I wasn't going to punch her. I wasn't, bro. Uh-huh. That's cool how they how they have him talking to NPCs. Keeping out of trouble, I hope. Sometimes. I need to access the deposit boxes for Frank Coletti. Ah, uh, yes. Mr. Angelo? Uh, yeah. Mr. Coletti said it might be you who came and to provide access. Please, follow me. Okay, well, I don't have access to my gun, so I can only imagine this is legit. You got, um, Ifumi helping me out right here. Thank you, brother. I appreciate it. the books and covered my tracks. Salieri never asked any questions. Wow. In fact, apart from the funeral, I never heard him talk about Frank again. Faked it. He faked it. I know that's not. I know that's not Morello. This is weird. You're making my boys twitchy, Marku. Sergio and I just came by to pay respects. That's all. Known Frank a long time. Almost as long as you. A good man, smart, loyal. 
loyal to his wife, his kid above all else. There must be some kind of honor in that in you. Maybe. But I'm still looking at this headstone with his little girl's name on it. It's a hell of a thing. It's like two grown men playing high school games. I used to have friends like this when I graduated high school that I would hang out with who would just power trip, bro, and make our little friend group as if it was some kind of like real, real posse, like, bro. And then like, I could just see this one particular friend try and like manipulate and act like he's the leader of whatever little group we had. Mind you, we're kids, you know what I'm saying? And so it's like, it's just looked at him and I'm like, bro, this shit is corny. But it's these, it's those kind of dudes that just like, like, like death is involved in this. You know what I'm saying? And they walking next to each other at their funeral, talking about trust. Mar uh, Salieri knows Morello was with, Salieri knows Frank was working with Morello and they still side by side at the funeral talking about, shit just corny, bro. I think I'm gonna end the episode right there, ladies and gentlemen. I hope that y'all are enjoying this series. I think we're about halfway done with the game. Gonna try and wrap this up very quickly before Cyberpunk drops so I can focus a little bit more attention on that. My plan with Cyberpunk, I'll probably just drop a video and then I'll probably like play it on my own, to be real. Um, it's a pretty long game and I don't wanna make that kind of commitment for the channel. But uh, I don't even know when this video is gonna drop. It might even be before. It's gonna be after Cyberpunk comes out. So, you know, y'all are just hearing my plans for the second time probably. But if you're enjoying this video, make sure that you slap a like, subscribe if you are new, hit that bell so you always know when I'm posting more vids. Love y'all, bro. I'll see you in the next one. Peace.